Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate auto reply to new message on Instagram using Socinator. This makes it easier to reply to new messages and filter the users we want to reply to. Let's start with the accounts manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right click on your account and hit go to tools. It will take you to the account configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on Instagram through Socinator. Let's go to the Auto Reply to New Message tab. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to reply to a number of messages within a period of time while narrowing the users down in the process. There are several configuration categories for Auto Reply to New Message. Let's begin with the first one, Message Filter. Here, you can either reply only to new pending message requests or to all messages. You may check this box if you want to reply to messages that contain specific words. Separate the words using comma. For example, hi, comma, hello. You may edit or delete using this clear all button over here, and it's gone. You may also upload from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Let's try it out. Select the right file, auto reply, click open, and it's successfully uploaded. When you're all set, click save. Socinator will then auto reply to messages that contain these words. Hi, hey, hello. The next one is manage messages, where you can create and manage the messages that you want to reply with. In the message text area, you can type your message you can say, hey, how are you? You may edit or delete using the clear all button. You may also import from CSV or text file. So let's try it out. Message open. And it's successfully uploaded. Queries allows you to filter the message according to our settings earlier. So we can select hi, hey, hello. When you're ready, add message to the list. On the messages list, you can see that we have added it. Action button allows you to edit or delete this specific message. You will reply, hi, how are you? To messages containing hi, hey, hello. The next tool is job configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should reply to the messages. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like slow for an average daily activities of 16, medium for 41, fast for 66, or super fast for 83. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each Instagram message is replied to. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after replying to the number of messages you've set in number of messages per job. Number of messages per job will allow you to specify the number of Instagram messages you want to reply to per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of messages to reply to per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box if you want to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another specific number of max messages per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to reply to new messages even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on, let's say, a Monday, click the trash bin button and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday, provide the start and end time, 12 a.m. to, let's say, 1.59 p.m., and click add interval. Let's add another one, 2 p.m. to 11.59 p.m., Click Add Interval. As you can see, you can have multiple time frames in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's name it Auto 
Reply, and click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time over here and click Auto Reply. The next tool is User Filters. This allows us to filter the users we want to reply to on Instagram. For example, the user we want to reply to should have a profile picture, so let's check the box. The user must have a minimum of 10 posts and a maximum of 20 posts. Minimum characters in bio should be 5. We can also set the minimum and maximum of the user's followings and followers. Let's say you don't want to reply to users who are into politics. Click must not contain specific words. Type politics government president for example you may edit or delete using this clear all button and it's gone you may also import from csv or text file by clicking this button let's select the right file must not have click open and it's uploaded successfully when you're all set click save so users with these texts in their bio will not be replied to even if they send you messages. The next one is the opposite of the previous one. If you want to reply to users who are, let's say, into pets, let's check must have at least one post with a caption containing specific words. Then let's type pets, cats, and dogs. You may edit or delete using this clear all button. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Choose the right file, Pets, and click Open. And it's successfully uploaded. Let's click Save. So users with these keywords will be searched by Socinator. And if they message you, Socinator will reply to these users. Next, we have Follow Ratio, which is ratio of followers and followings. You can input a follow ratio less than or greater than a specific number. You can also provide a follow ratio in a specific range between two numbers. If you want to reply to an active user, click should have posted within the last 10 days. Filter by gender allows you to ignore specific users according to their gender. So if you don't want to reply to, let's say, males, then you can check ignore males. Skip non-English users will not reply to users with non-English text in their profile. This will make it easier for you to target English-speaking people around the world. Be careful in using too much user filters, though. They are not perfect, and using a lot at the same time is therefore not encouraged. You can also ignore private users, business profiles, and verified accounts. The last configuration category is Manage Blacklisted Users. Blacklisted users are the Instagram profiles you do not want the software to interact with. In this case, Software will not reply to the messages of blacklisted users when this box is checked. This can be a private blacklist, which is actually a blacklist that belongs to a specific Instagram account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. When you are satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start replying to new messages, let's scroll up and hit the Save button. After saving, click the status button over here to make it active. Let me show you another option in automating auto reply to new message on Instagram using Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and under the social drop down button, let's select Instagram. This will take us to the accounts tab. Let's switch to Instachat over here and make sure you are under auto reply to new message on the left side of the app because we want to auto reply to new messages here we can create and name our campaign let's call it Instagram auto reply to new message under message filter let's reply to all messages under manage messages let's say hi how are you Add message to the list. Under job configuration, slow should be okay. Under user filters, 
should have a profile picture minimum of 10 and maximum of 20 minimum of five characters in the bio let's skip non-english users and ignore verified accounts and also skip blacklisted users when you're ready let's click the blue button select accounts so in this part you can select multiple instagram accounts since you only have one account right now let's go with that by checking the box and click save after saving let's click the red button create campaign it will automatically take us to the campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our instagram auto reply to new message campaign the action button over here will allow you to edit duplicate or delete the campaign you may also click the status button to pause it and that's it for this tutorial i hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching